Ladies and gentlemen, allow me to present to you FTB University 1.19, a mod pack that aims to teach more complex mods. But I'm not gonna ramble on too long because the mod pack explains itself pretty well. So let's get started. Welcome to FTB University 1.19. This pack aims to teach more complex mods to experienced players, like I just said. Now, the first thing that we're going to pick here is this. That's an advanced house. You could pick one of the other ones. That's fine. But this mod pack focuses on getting right into the good stuff like mods and such and basically we we, we can uh, we, we can basically pick a house with this I, I don't remember how to click this I think you have to click the ground but I'm not gonna do that just yet uh, anyway if we continue back here in the quests we learn how to read through the quest so quest text is color coded to make it easier to read blue text is highlighted the, is to highlight the task gold text is important information yellow text is for mod names purple text has something when you hover over it it might even have a click function indicated by mouse oh yeah oh yeah love it I can do this all day I can do this all day this is the rest of the episode that oh no anyway uh, let us continue, shall we? Some quests have multiple pages. This is visible at the bottom right. You can navigate by clicking uh, or scrolling. Click me, done, and we get a stack of torches. So basically, this mod pack, right off the bat, it gives you like the essential items, like a base. We, we can literally plop this down and get a base, like just like this, right? At, and it literally spawns in front of us, and I'll show you that later. Now, with that done, if we go out here, as you can see, there are not that many tabs, and that will be explained in just a second. If we go into here, you may have noticed that there don't seem to be very many chapters. They are there, you just can't see them. Each mod has, has its own chapter, but having access to all of them immediately can make it a bit overwhelming due to choice paralysis. This chapter aims to ease you into each mod, giving a short short blurb about what it does and when you should be using it. Complete the mod's introduction quest to unlock its chapter. So we have understood that. So basically these are the mods like kind of overall. So we have gear, we have storage and automation. We have technology in which we have Botania, Create Mercy Engineering, Mechanism version 10, uh, something. Uh, our own tools and in magic we have Ars Novo, Botania, Evilcraft, Hex Casting and Nature's Aurora. So again, this mod pack is about teaching you how to use these mods. And if we go into here, useful things. This is the same thing. This chapter is fairly simple. Each quest has every item that does a specific thing. For example, there's a quest for every mob spawner and another for every mob killer. A quest for things to fly and one for teleporting. And we can unlock this uh, once we've played for half an hour. So hopefully that should be done today. But for example, mob spawners in here, there's all sorts of stuff in there. Um, mob movers, mob killers, FE generators, a bunch of generation things here, which we can then unlock down the the road, etc. And already we have this miscellaneous under storage and automation in which we are kind of guided right off the bat here. So we have storage. So this is drawers. So it's kind of telling us, hey, make a drawer. Once you've made that, make a storage controller. And things are explained kind of like this. And we have things down here, like bigger on the inside. Uh, is these? Oh, that's tanks. Oh, that's very cool. Um, we also have like laser IO and things like that. And you kind of learn as you go with also pictures and stuff like that. However, I am missing one thing here. Ah, that is FTB Schools, Interactive Tutorial Areas. FTB Schools is a custom mod that allows us to create interactive tutorial areas somewhat similar to Pandas, but you do more than watch. When you enter a school, the structure is generated in a void world and you are teleported to it. Items cannot be taken out of the schools and you cannot bring items in. Schools are effectively non-canon. The point is to learn, not to progress. You can enter schools by using the command school enter, followed by the school ID. Several quests have clickable text that runs the command for you to send you to specific schools. So if I just do that real quick, as you can see, if we do school, uh, enter, if I, can, if I can hit the right buttons, and there are a bunch of stuff. So there are four for uh, applied logistics, for example. We have some for Botania. Uh, we have some for create, like in the farm category. We have miscellaneous, one for laser, laser IO, uh, etc. which is really, really cool. So that's a way you can easier learn things. But before we can get into that, I need to place this advanced house down, which I really do want to. I just don't know where but this island kind of looks cool and I think it's in yes it's in this direction um right I, sh I should however probably do we have Ooh, I, I need to see do we have vein uh ftb ultimate yes 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 <laughs> we do indeed I don't need that <laughs> oh yeah
yeah. <laughs> Perfect. Yep. Makes life a whole lot more easy. So now I can make a crafty table. Can I make it? Yes, crafty station. Perfect. That is beautiful. Gotta love it. I love it. All right. I'm just quickly going to make the basics here, uh, like a pickaxe and an axe. And I think that is going to do for now. I will also pick up those sticks because you never know when you're going to need them. And now let's head, us, head towards that island, which hopefully is going to be our base. I want a fairly flat ground to plop down this house that we've gotten. And I think this could potentially do. I mean, there's a tower over there. That's not too bad. Uh, what's this? Oh, uh, I got slow falling and oiled. Oh, so it's do we have oil? Ooh, wait, do we have oil? Crude bucket oil. Oh, what can we please tell? Please tell me we can generate power with this. We can we can definitely make gasoline and diesel. Please tell me it's possible to like generate power using this stuff. Please tell me it's possible. I, I don't know if it is. But that would be so cool having oil here and then being able to generate power with it. Right. Uh, I think I'm I think I'm satisfied with this place. Um, I'm going to place the house with, ah, you know, this oil is, is kind of annoying because it's right where I wanted to place the house. Like I really wanted to be on the on this island. Um, I might just start clearing the trees first. I, mm, that's actually that's actually kind of annoying. <laughs> I really want this oil to be here, but I don't want to place my house right in front of it. You know, and I, I'll have to make an oil bridge, which is not that cool hmm okay to be fair there is a lot of oil around so i think i think it's fine right i'm going to not mine out that area i'm going to quickly make a shovel and i'm going to mine out this area here and that tree as well and then we'll place the house back here i think it's fine i think it'll be fine it'll be fine it'll be fine okay there we go and quickly mine this away we get everything yes perfect right uh i'm not 100 sure how this works this is kind of in the center i suppose not really i suppose over here is the center let's play is it all the way over here? I don't know how this works. Um, okay, right. So we have a different types of houses. So we have this house. It shows us a little bit of preview here. And we can see how it looks on the inside. Plenty of furnaces. Wow. Uh, huge storage room right here. I kind of like that because it's modded and that looks like it'll be cool. Maybe it's farm area. I don't know. It's a workshop anyway. Uh, we got estate. That looks big as well. Estate looks really cool. Um, this looks cool as well. However, I don't know how practical it's actually going to be it looks very open not very friendly when it comes to that i actually don't know which one to i kind of like this like on the inside pictures but i also do like the estate but i don't feel like that's really me let's preview this okay right click on any block in the world to remove the preview the yellow outline is the block you clicked on right so you have the uh the way in here there's some doors there's a hallway then you go in here then you have some automatic farms you have an upstairs so we do have this don't know what's upstairs really let's find out by oh, okay i'm gonna have to do this then make a little bit of a staircase i suppose Oh, sun is going down. We do kind of want to get this down, I think. Uh, preview. And I think we can go up and kind of get a little bit of... The Ooh, okay, so this is a storage room. We also have some cactus in there. Some, what's that, farming plots? Uh, enchanting area. Okay, I think I like this. I think I, I think I like this. I'm gonna go for it. I'm gonna go for it. Uh, I do need to quickly make sure again that it actually fits on this land, which... Oh, it actually does. It just about fits. Okay, perfect. I'm gonna plop it down right here then in front of this... <laughs> in front of this oil. Right. Uh, bed color. I'm not gonna do red. Like, that's... No. We'll do blue. What's, what's light blue? Light blue. Built... <laughs> Oh, yeah. Now that's how you build in Minecraft. <laughs> All right, let's check it out where it's not. I think, I think it I think it ate my crafting table. Anyway, this is our entrance going in. Bunch of seeds. That's fine. Don't have any food. That's also fine, I suppose. Uh, let's go left first. We even have pictures. We have the smeltery in here. So we have smokers. We have blast furnaces and everything. That's really awesome. Again, this mod pack aims towards getting you started with the with the like the the modded stuff, not having to set up like the basics, etc. Automatic. Okay, semi-automatic sugar game farm but that is easily fixed two enchantment tables wow okay that that's a turn uh makes rare enchantment more common and increases the number of enchantment. i i don't i don't i don't know how that works we'll get back to that hopefully and there's my bed and we even have some food in here and that's a lot of storage yeah th this is this is what i like to see this is what i like to see i like it uh and now i did take off 
What's this? Okay, plants are cool. I did take off build mine shaft. I'm gonna sleep real quick. But I did take off in the in the build setting to uh make a mine shaft. I just don't know where that is going to be located. Um would be ideal with a basement here, maybe. Or maybe it's outside. I will inspect outside. Okay, so far nothing. So far just this building. Maybe it's there, maybe I just haven't found it yet. I, I don't know what it is, but I assume it's there somewhere, right? It it, it kinda has to be. Maybe. Or maybe this one just don't have my chef i don't know right well first thing i'm going to do is hit on up here go to this place here and because i am liking food i'm going to plant these wheat seeds right off the bat and potentially also i kind of want to get the industrial herb seeds down as well well i only do have two wheat seeds remaining so i, I will do that because i feel like string is probably something that we will need down the road at some point there we go that's fine well we even have stone cutters we have the loom crafting table and cartography table i will do this is my first this is my first modification right here better <laughs> <laughs> and now I'm going to go ahead and do this and then the remaining 16 logs I'm going to go ahead and put them in the I was about to say smoker but that's not what I'm going to do I'm going to split it into how many furnaces do we have four I'm going to split it into four drop that in there oh I have fuel why oh, didn't oh, I didn't realize that do, do these have no but these do okay that's sick I did I didn't realize that anyway I'm going to take uh this charcoal and I'm going to bring it with me upstairs where the campfires are the, uh, are at and it can give us a little bit of stuff food and oh, i don't how do you i forgot how you some for some reason i feel like you right click a cat you, you know what i got a, I got a better solution i mean this will give me charcoal that, that was a complete waste of wood honestly waste of wood and waste of coal as well that was <sighs> it's fine this is what i'm doing instead do this do this you get this and this and you get this and this i'm gonna eat this and, and i'll eat that now while we're waiting for these smokers to quickly finish their job if you wish to catch my live streams be sure to follow me on twitch.tv slash binary I'm most likely going to be streaming from this world quite a bit, so if you are interested in catching that, be sure to head on over there and drop a follow. But anyways, with that said, with food now secured, I feel like we can go ahead and check out that tower. But I do also want to uh, check out the quest even further. Storage is something that we want to get into, but again, resources is something that I need. We also have mob grinding, we have tech call, we also have mob toggles, but reaching the mob pack folder. Learn how to reach the mob pack installation folder. So it even teaches you how to to like navigate and add and remove mods that's sick for people that are not that used to fiddling with mods that's awesome anyway i need resources which again is why i'm plugging my twitch because that is most likely a bunch of stuff that i will be doing while live streaming Ooh, what's this nothing literally nothing this on the other hand is really cool Ooh, i'm not gonna take it i don't feel like you should eat something that is glowing i feel like that's probably a bad idea right this tower is either going to be good or it's gonna kill me. Ooh, not a diamond for sure. Hmm. Oh, what's this? Something. Another one. I feel like this is too easy. I feel like this is too easy. Ooh. Okay, maybe not. No, okay, I knew it. I should have grabbed the stuff before running. Okay, that's empty. And still fish, apparently. I can't punch. Yeah, I think that loot got destroyed. I should have been quicker taking it. I, 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 part of me knew that I could easily have grabbed that. Uh, I should have known. 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 Right, well, now I have a tower that has been blown up in front of my house. Great view. <laughs> Uh, okay. I'm gonna head towards whatever this is, I think. Just do a little bit more exploring. Um, yeah, yeah. Uh, that doesn't look safe either. That. Nope. 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 No one. I have a wooden axe. I have a. Ah! I have a. I have a wooden axe. Help me, whatever you are. Whoa! You're fast. You are fast, pal. Grab me this. <laughs> okay. Nope. Nope, 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 go away. Okay, I'm gonna need some armor before taking that on. That's, <laughs> that was, uh, hmm, interesting. Well, look at this, we have this area over here, we have a big savannah over there, maybe that has something interesting. Uh, I do want to check that out, I have no armor, I have no nothing. Ideally, I should probably be mining, or at least looking into getting, uh, not this, yeah, getting into Tetra, getting, like, tools and such. Actually, I'm gonna check mark 
this, which is going to unlock this from the tab. And that is going to teach us how to progress in Tetra. Uh, hopefully also how to make our first tools and such. Let's see what this is though. Um, right, I see loot. I will fight for loot, even though, oh, crossbow. Oh, crossbow, hold up. I can, I can do this, I can do this, yeah, I can do this. I'm a pro, I'm a pro Minecraft. Aha, I, I'm a pro Minecraft. But you spawned though, just avoid, avoid. That's only too hot damage, that's fine. My axe did break. You know what, I'm, uh, can I? Okay, I'm not gonna, actually, I will just vein mine all that. Yeah, Stone Age indeed. Uh, let's go ahead and get a stone pickaxe real quick, and then quickly get a stone axe, because I feel like that is something that I'm going to need very shortly. And it is also getting nighttime, which is probably not ideal, but here goes anyway. I, I really want whatever is in here. Um, however, I assume that that guy, yeah, spawner. Did I just hear a normal villager? Okay, those are shooters. I do not have a, oh, these guys captured a villager. Okay, okay, don't miss, mate. Take that. Missed. Hit your friend. Oh, yeah. Look at these moves. Okay. Ooh. Whoa. Okay, so there's a spawner over here somewhere. Oh, that is. That is. Get rid of that. It'll just spawner. Gone. Boom. Defeated, I think. Except for you. Oh, another tower. Okay, there are two of these. Okay, these guys are with the... Okay. Hi. I have another way of dealing with you. We're just climbing up here. Eating. Ooh, what's that? Is that a village? Ooh, that's a village. Quite close by. With a wolf den. Lovely. And a portal. Okay. We're, we're, we're gonna we're gonna go there. Um, Village I can sleep at. Okay, please go away now. Thank you. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what that is. I don't know what that is. Uh, that guy is getting pretty far away, so I think we're pretty good from that point. Uh, okay, I really would like to... S Ooh, red seat. Ooh. Oh, these are items. Okay, I'm gonna take this. Uh, I I'm, I apologize, Vilger. I know I should say, be saving you, but this is very, very useful stuff. Um, ooh. You know what? I'm, I'm gonna take it all. I'm just gonna take it all. It's fine. Everything's fine. I don't know what this is. Some book. Evocus orders. Probably important. Oh, a cage with a bird in it. Can I have that? How do I free bird? I want a free bird. <laughs> I want to free the bird. Okay, let's open this. Ooh. Okay. I got enough experience. I don't need all this stuff, do I? I really don't need all this stuff. Can I eat? I can. I feel like I'm gonna get jumped any at any moment. What's this? Peter's journal. Right. To be honest, I think you're going to be safer in there until I can transport you to a safe place. Um I do apologize, but that is that is my judgment and I'm sticking to it. <laughs> Right, uh, I really should get this guy, shouldn't I? Yeah, I'm gonna get this guy. Yeah, that's right. Come and get me. No chance. Be gone. Uh, okay, that just shows where villages are. I'm gonna go over here to this village and sleep. Maybe they have some... Actually, how far am I from home? Pretty far. Not that far. I'm gonna go home, uh, clean up inventory, and then I'll be back at that village. Even though this journey is probably going to be very dangerous and stupid, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Okay, spiders and that, that mod is a thing. Okay, got it. Okay, skeleton, zombie, uh, raccoon. Looks very scary. Scary, but isn't raccoons fine raccoons are cool raccoons are honestly cute what, what are you tasmanian devil okay th those are actually cute some might say that they look ugly i think they're cute okay, a bunch of oh oh hi um okay kind of oh yeah no uh kind of was being overwhelmed there by by the enemies um but very cool ravine me like okay, i kind of feel like i'm losing home okay it's over here there it is okay it is a bit of a journey actually what are you fellas doing on my island. Oop. Wait, I have a stack of torches. Why haven't I lit the place up? Bruh. Okay, first, I gotta reconquer what is rightfully... Oh, no, I, I love those. Okay, please go away. Please go away. I will fight. Why? No, that creeper. Creepers are not supposed to look like that. Aha. Ooh, armor. Lovely. Okay, please go away. Please go away. Please go away. Okay, uh, I'm gonna sleep. Let these guys burn up. Clear my inventory. Uh, and then we'll get back to it. I think that's a proper plan. I like my plan. My plan is good. My plan is great. Okay, this is a lot of stuff to sort already uh right I, i'm gonna make a gems chest because that i feel like that's something i'm going to get a lot of like these weird gems so i'm just gonna do that i'm gonna then make a very val valuable yeah, valuable chest there um this axe can replace my other axe then we will have a wooden chest i think over here for stuff like this bison fur wow we're then going to have a mob drop chest probably not run flash because that's contrasting well to that so we'll put it there we'll have Food items down here. Piercing and unbreaking. Not bad. I will actually take it. So I feel like that's something I will be needing at some point. Uh, we'll do that there because that means we can put nature stuff in there. But I will keep the dirt because that, I believe, has saved my life uh, once already. Maybe. I think that was just a crow. That's fine. And then I definitely need a chest for random things. Like a, a glass rain. How more random could it be? <laughs> 
Now we do have a couple of books here, Evoker's Orders, Journal Day 153. The Evoker sent us on a scouting mission to find the Labyrinth of Mysteries. They think some secret treasure is hidden there. I think they have no idea what they're talking about. We could really use some new leadership among the Illagers. Ooh, I wonder if that's a hint. Do I have, I don't have bookshelves. Oh, do, do we have bookshelves? Bookshelf, doesn't look like we have something that we can interact with. Unfortunately, Peter's Journal, Journal Day 64. Today a crow attacked Johnny, can you believe it? A crow. He convinced us it was a witch in disguise, so we were cap so we captured it. Oh, that's the one I have. We're taking it back to the fortress. Either Johnny is right or he's losing it. Just between you and me, I think Johnny lost it a long time ago. Wait, that's this guy. Shift to place. I don't I don't know how to get you out, buddy. I, I really don't know how to get you out. I do apologize, but be here. Oh! Oh well that was oh, oh it has to be. Can I Okay, I, uh, uh, stay there. I will find a suitable place for you soon. <laughs> All right, let us go ahead and, ooh, quest completed. So that would be this right here. Very cool. So now we've unlocked this section, essentially. Uh, oh, that's what I heard. You little stinker. You, no, just, just no. What's that? Is that a good cave? Okay, I think that's a good cave. I don't think that's a wolf, wolf cave. Please don't explode. Okay, yeah, I'm just gonna put a few torches here because chances I'm probably going to... What's this? I thought that might have been the mineshaft. <laughs> that would have been nice. Um, but yeah, who, I, the chances are I'm probably going to get back here at night time again. The, it, it's high, I think. So I'm just going to plop down a couple torches before we leave. Ooh, I just saw another tower back there. Okay, so even though we kind of blew up this one... <laughs> look at it from from a distance. Uh, I, I think it's fine. We, we could get more stuff. I saw a chance of books and stuff like that. So probably want to get to that at some point. What are you? You're beautiful. I kind of want to catch you. I, I need a birdhouse. I need a really big birdhouse. That, that's just something I have to make. What's this? What was that? Some light? What's that? Blue stuff? Interesting stuff. Right, getting sidetracked. I want to check out that village and the places around it. And there's a drown behind me. Okay, it doesn't have a trident. We're good. Oh, hello. Trick me. This is the ravine again, where I was attacked by spiders. A lot of stuff down there. I wonder if the crystals... I mean, I assume the crystals are useful. I just don't know yet. Whee. I will bring up these bones, because you never know if you need some bones meal and here's the outpost sorry so, sorry buddy i i will come back for you eventually maybe but don't tell him that <laughs> all right let's check out this village i'm sure it has a bunch of food like uh wheat and stuff like that and i might try and take that tower i don't know if it's i don't think it's possible to disarm it but it is definitely possible for me to grab the loot before it it explodes i think oh yeah lots of hay bales let's check out these houses oh yeah oh again gems i'll definitely take all this stuff though because that is probably very useful and I'll take this bed as well. <laughs> that, this is going to be my travel bed. No one can stop me in this village anyway. Ooh, upgrade for my shovel. I feel kind of bad doing this, but I, I need to survive. Basically, right, here's the thing. Villagers, you don't need food. You don't need food to survive. It, it's that easy. They just don't need... Ooh, blacksmith. They just don't need... Ooh. Ugh. Interesting. They just don't need food to survive. I mean, it's that simple. They really, really don't. And it looks like I can get a horse now. And I have some good... Ooh. Yeah, they... We... I... What's this? I don't know what this part does. But like I was trying to say, these villagers, they don't need food to survive. They'll be fine without it. Uh, uncommon last lost knowledge. An uncommon knowledge pattern. This can be used in a knowledge holder to help with creating implements. Okay, sounds useful. I do want a few more hay bales before we move on. Something like these. And these... Right, so we have jungle over here. I just saw the tip of a triangle tree over there. Another wolf den, most likely. I'll take a peek, which is probably a bad idea. We have some horses over here, which would be kind of nice to get one of those for faster travel. Uh, stop. Oh, that's a, that's a mob. We also have one over there. We also have a creator, which I want to check out, and another portal over there. So, I suppose we should go for the horses, right? So, if we go right, take the horse, sleep, and head back. Check this out, check this out, hold this, and loop back around. I think that's the plan. After taking the tower. I mean, it's fair. And if anything, we'll get gems from this tower, which is going to... Please tell me, do we have a backpack? Backpack. Ooh, we do. I wonder, is that going to be a quest thing? Uh, miscellaneous. Yes. Sophisticated backpacks. Good. That is a quest. And we actually have everything we need in order to make one of these. Maybe not the iron one, but we can definitely get that started. That, I will have to make ASAP. Get all these gems. Right. One thing I did just realize is when I open this, I won't be able to grab anything. <laughs> so I think I'm actually going to leave this tower here because I feel like the books are going to be very important. Um, or not super important, but like very good to have. So I'm going to leave this tower intact. How about that? And I will take a sneak peek. 
Nope, those are wolves. Don't need to take a sneak peek at that. Everything's fine. Just gotta go the other direction. Oh, I'm gone. Okay, this house is bigger. Maybe. Oh, yes. Uh, that's something, 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 something. And horses are located. Before we continue, quickly check map to see. Oh, we got another village over here. Good to know. I'm not gonna go to it just yet, though. We also have something interesting over here. But first, sleep. Now, uh, can I drop gunpowder? Okay. Okay, you are fast. I'm definitely picking you. You also have good health. You are very fast, I feel. Come on. Eventually, eventually, eventually. Come on. Wow, you're stubborn. Finally, buddy. Okay, uh, change my mind. I'm gonna check out this. Don't know what it is. I'm curious. Okay, this horse is good. Woo wee! -woo. Ah, don't lose it now. <laughs> this horse is great. Um, I, I don't know what that is. Is that another camp? Oh, that's another camp. That's another villager in need of assistance. Definitely not why I'm going down there. Man, this horse is fast though. Like really, really fast. This guy I don't want to lose. Okay, um, I don't want to lose you. So you stay here. I'll go and take care of this. Uh, where's my axe when I need it? I am sure that there will be spawners around here somewhere or not. Oh, this is a friendly camp with no loot on it. Okay, never mind then. <laughs> There's another village thing over here. Oh, wandering trader. Hello. Any oh, okay. Uh, mangrove, purple ghoul, pillager fortress map? Kind of want that, can't afford it though. Old growth pine, okay, that's cool. Right, I kind of want to check out this. I, I'm going further and further away from where I'm supposed to go. I'm supposed to go down here, but I mean, with this horse, it's going to be pretty fast anyway. It's probably just another normal village. Yeah, that's what it is. I'm not going to check it out now. Uh, I'm going to go back and check that, uh, what's it called, that that portal place. Rune portal, that's the one. Okay, that's the original <coughs> camp. Oh, sorry, buddy. Woo! Okay, do need to be careful where you ride with this thing. Okay, so this is a village, so I need to take a hard left here. Across the water, not across here. Best way to cross is probably right here. Don't know how far you can actually jump. Not bad. This horse is amazing. Crater should be right up here. Oh, Crater is right up here. Uh, whoa, hello. Whoa, hello. Okay, okay, that's big. Uh, yeah, that's applied to the GSX. I thought as much. What is this? But don't move. Please do not move. Wow. I mean, that's that's some sort of construction. Uh, that goes down deep. Okay. Um, plenty to uh, pl plenty to explore eventually. <laughs> Why is there a, wait, wait, this is a beacon thing. What is this? Hello? Horse, you stay. Uh, isn't this a beacon thing? I kind of want to go in, but I also am quite scared. Uh, right, drop the, no, 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 I need, bruh. <sighs> right, I don't know where the original entrance to this thing is, but I'm gonna, I'm about to make my own. What? That's a lot of stuff. That's a very much lot of stuff. What is that? I want to get in. I want to get in, but it doesn't seem like there's an entrance. Unless you have to mine away for it. On purpose. Water. I assume that's what... No? Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Environmental accumulator. Um... That sounds bad. <laughs> that kind of sounds bad. Um, right, this place is interesting. We can come back to it. That's just so much stuff to check out. Right, rune portal is right over here, which we will check out now. Uh, ooh, uh, I don't know what I'm looking for. Power, oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, slot hands, ha hands. No, oh wait, there we go, maybe. There we go, perfect, I like that. Uh, one obsidian, I'll take the flint and steel. Um, compressed stone, that sounds valuable. More more valuable than that. Uh, transistor, probably. Golden apple. And I mean, I know where I can get this obsidian now, so that is very handy, actually. Looks like there's another outpost over there, but I think that is going to do it for this exploration. Not bad. We have explored a decent area. We've seen multiple villages. We have one over here, one over here, which we have not explored yet. We have these places here, which require some combat. Uh, plenty of oil places all around. I think what I'm gonna do now is slowly head towards home, which I'm going to set a waypoint so I can find it easily. Uh, and yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna head towards home and we'll call it a day. Not a bad trip though whatsoever. However, that island is surrounded by all these trees. Not ideal for a horseback and another tower of which I'm not going to trust. The first tower I tried entering kind of blew up. Since then, trust issues. <laughs> I'm not gonna go past that because that's just a death sentence, most likely, waiting to happen. Um, this is the... Whoa, that's a lot of caving. I do need to go caving. Again, twitch.tv slash binary vigilante. 
almost jumped the entire way except for a couple of blocks. Wow, not bad. Right, you can't come with me, but I can do this. You're staying here and you know what? Fine, fine, fine. There we go. You can eat now. You can eat stuff. Yeah, you can't come with me inside. I'm so unfortunately, I'm sorry. Right, ladies and gentlemen, overall, not too bad of a start. We have some basic equipment. We have a bunch of different stuff, half of which I don't know. Actually, most of which I should say, I don't know what is used for. Uh, so that is something that we will have to explore. However, the first mod that we should probably look into, first of all, is sophisticated backpacks for exploring. However, uh, for more practical things, Tetra is probably going to be the right way forward because that allows us to make some custom tools, etc. I think that's how that works. Um, other than that, we have this. Modifies the way several vanilla mechanic, making them much more powerful. That sounds like something that we could use. Um, and then slowly but surely moving into maybe some more storage and things like that. But like I said, that's going to be it for this episode. I really hope that you have enjoyed. If you did, be sure to leave a like, subscribe if you're doing any of those notifications so you don't miss any future uploads. And uh, yeah, I hope to see you next time. So with that said, have a wonderful day and until next time, goodbye. Actually, we have a pretty good view of the sunset. If it wasn't for that tower. I, I have to bring it down. I have to bring the tower down. Uh, see you next time. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.